going to perform cycling for the abdominal core bend your knees and make as if you are cycling bringing into your abdomen other way around in yoga there are two core the main one is abdomen and the second is your upper arms and the shoulders if you conquer both of them make them stronger you can practice any asana any posture now bring your legs up onto 90 degree up straight without bend and with exhale bring them down inhale up if you cannot bring on the 90 degree that is okay exhale down slowly inhale up and exhale down do it slow and with control inhale up and exhale down last one inhale up and exhale down release and relax we're going to practice some back bendings stretch your hands forward forehead down focus inhale bring your right leg left hand and head up head up exhale down inhale left leg right hand and head up exhale down now inhale bring your both hands both legs and head up breathe into your abdomen keep your mouth gently closed exhale down go back into makrasana the crocodile pose a healing balm for your back Cobra, bring your hands, palms under your shoulder, forehead down, five fingers wide open, inhale, lift your head up, shoulders up, push with your hands and arch your back, relax your shoulder, tuck your elbows by the side and breathe, stay for as many breaths as comfortable cobra bring your palm under your shoulder five fingers wide open forehead down inhale lift your head up shoulders up push with your hands and arch your back keep your eyes closed and mouth gently breathe through your nose into your abdomen relax your shoulders tuck your elbows by the side and stay for as many breaths as possible a healing balm pose for your back exhale down and go back into makrasana the crocodile pose a perfect pose for aligning your spine back to normal Salbhasana, take your hands under your body, chin out, chin on the ground, take your elbows as in under the body as possible, 
then inhale bring your right leg up exhale down inhale left leg up exhale down inhale right leg up exhale down leg up exhale down now we will try both legs together don't have to try too hard try what is comfortable hold for as many breaths as possible and come down whenever you're ready and go back into crocodile pose makrasana giving a gentle massage onto your abdomen as well as your back crocodile pose is simple but very effective dhanurasana the bow pose bend your knees hold your ankles forehead down then inhale lift your head up shoulders up chest up legs up stand on your abdomen breathe into your abdomen stay as many breaths as comfortable exhale come down and go back into makrasana stay in makrasana take a long deep breath and with exhale release the tension tightness push with your hands go into cat pose cat pose push with your hands and stand on your knees and the hands now inhale lift your head up arch your back Exhale, chin to the chest. Inhale, lift your head up, arch your back. Arch as much as possible without a strain or pain. Exhale, chin to the chest. Inhale, lift your head up and arch your back. Exhale, chin to the chest. Inhale up, exhale down, inhale up, exhale down, inhale up, exhale down, continue the same movement, these movements are going to make your back flexible and bring more fluid into your spine and keep your spine healthy therefore you stay younger because the nervous system that's going through the spine is getting stimulated that now go back into child pose and relax in the child pose open your knees bring your forehead on the ground stretch your arms forward and stay relaxed child pose also very simple but effective asana if you are having problem with migraine headache tension depression you can practice the child pose between 10 or 15 minutes every day and get the best result relaxing your mind as well as your body